This is a short video illustrating a technique we use to inject ranibizumab into the eye at the University of Iowa. We first place a topical anesthetic into the eye, and this is followed by a topical antibiotic. Next, we inject a small amount of xylocaine subconjunctivally. Usually, this is in the superior temporal quadrant. We raise a bleb of the anesthetic and allow this to remain in place for three minutes or more for anesthesia. While the anesthesia is taking effect, we paint the area of the conjunctiva where we are going to inject with 5% povidone iodine. We then remove the ranibizumab from the uh, bottle using the uh, large bore syringe provided by the company. This large syringe is then replaced with a 30 gauge needle and the syringe is checked to make sure we then have a 0 0.05 milliliter or 5 milligram dose. A lidded speculum is inserted into the eye. An area 3.5 millimeters from the limbus is marked with calipers often will replace 5% povidone iodine prior to injection. The 30 gauge needle is then directed into the middle of the vitreous cavity and the drug is slowly injected. A cotton tip applicator is placed over the injection site to prevent reflux of fluid or medication. The lid speculum then is gently removed and the eye is irrigated to remove any excess povidone iodine, which is an irritant. An antibiotic drop is placed. The vision is briefly checked to make sure there's at least light perception after the injection. The patient is then instructed to go home and continue the antibiotic drops for three days.